ladies, they're sexy and they're they're fashionable, but and sometimes they can even tell a little bit about your personality. Hats are in, but get yes. this: apparently, the right hat can get you the right guy. Ooh, that's always nice when that happens. And right to show you uh, here, the hats that bound that are bound to boost your love life are uh, the co-owners of Eyelids, Kristen Winicky and Lisa Wilson. All Thank right. you for joining us, here, ladies. Okay, so what are eyelids? <laughs> what is that? Well, other than these, what it's are eyelids? It's a dot eyelids? com, right? Eyelids.com? Hot eyelids.com. Hot, Hot eyelids. Eyelids. Okay. Yeah. okay, what is it? Um, it's our designer internet headwear company that started as an internet business, but we started just selling into boutiques too because headwear is making such a humongous So I'm assuming comeback. you make hats. Yes, yes we okay. do. Okay. Uh, I don't know why you'd assume that, but yes, we do. Okay. I think well, it's women, eyelids. I thought you made mascara. Yeah, I think <laughs> women are very attractive when they wear hats. And I mean, those hats look very cute on you. So I don't yeah. know, if, is it a seasonal thing or is there hats you can wear throughout the year all, all the time? All year round. It depends just on fabrics and styles. We just stay with the trends, but you can definitely wear a hat year round. My, my wife has more hats than she does shoes. My wife is a hat really? lady. She are there, uh, yeah. Hats, yeah. Are there women, though, who should not wear hats or like a head shape that says, don't wear a hat? I don't think so. I think we have so many different styles, and there's different styles that definitely accentuate certain features, so there's definitely a hat for everyone. Okay. There's a hat fact, for everyone. These hats are for you guys. This one's oh. for you, and this one's for you. See, so hats are cool for guys, too. That one's crazy. It accents you a crazy personality. Oh, this is like rerun now. <laughs> <laughs> No offense to my friend Dorian, though, but uh, unless you're a cowboy, a sailor, or one of the village people, I don't think men should wear hats. No, you look really good in that. I'm digging this hat. I like yes, it. I like Start the show. Simple. Oh, well, thank you. Now, can, can a hat really attract uh, a certain type of guy? Definitely. Men are attracted to different personalities. Our hats portray different personalities. So you find the right hat, you'll find the right guy. Okay, easily said. Let's see it work. Here we go. Let's check out the first woman and her hat. All right, let's see her. Oh, okay. This woman... Okay. This woman screams club rat and like just wants to hit the nightlife and she's gonna attract that bar fly kind of guy. Okay, I think you were right in the beginning. This woman screams. I just have that feeling. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go that uh, she's into the kind of guy that would wear a, a vest with no shirt. That kind oh, of guy. Uh, uh, hence the bar guy. Okay. Are we right, yes, girls? You're what do you perfectly think? right. Yes. We are? Dude, we that rock. never happens on this show. <laughs> All right, well, now, thank you very much, because right. I think we have another one we're going to try to guess. Okay, cool. Yeah. Oh, I like this this one. Okay. This look is very sick. This is very similar to one of the ladies right here. This is this is conservative yet sexy, you know? And she, fashion is very important to this woman. I think she wants her man to be very fashionable, too. Okay, yeah. this woman is a bookie and only interested in the dead-end kids. <laughs> <laughs> How do we do? How do we do? I don't know about you. You scare me. <laughs> She's gonna have armbands on and deal in blackjack. Yeah, she's definitely into fashion. She's definitely gonna attract the kind of guy that cares about fashion, maybe models. And All right, I'm like so two for two. You're two right for two, now. I'm one for two. Thank All you right. very Thank much. You very Thank much. you very much. Can we have the next hat, Let's please? Let's check out the next hat, lady. All okay, right, very cool. this woman screams. She. She's, okay, first of all, I don't know, she appears very young. Right. And I think the hat makes her even appear younger. Okay. So she might be looking for a young guy. Uh, 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 <laughs> a younger man. I feel that this woman likes to hang out in front of the airport and ask me for a dollar. <laughs> I'm kind of getting that vibe, too. Vibe, that's She's very free-spirited. She might attract a poet. Hello, maintenance. You're, you're right. I'm going to go, I'm right on I was going to go with more granola, too. She's very, a little yeah, granola. Yeah, perfect she might be right. All right, okay, thank, thank you very much. Okay, thank you very much. Do we have any other hat ladies? Yeah. These are all from I love these hats. These are great. These are great hats. Oh, okay. There we go. We're using them. Okay. Well, that's not fair. Her whole vibe says she works out, she's healthy, she jogs on the beach. She's one of Mario. She should be from Mario. See, I think, well, at the same time, I get a little bit more of a hip-hop vibe, a little J-Lo with this woman. And I think and I think she might uh, she might attract that same kind of cat who's a little more into rap and the R&B thing. Yeah, definitely. A, I'm going with the health nut guy. She's going to attract yeah. a jogger. I didn't see your your interpretation, but now I do now that you said it. So look, you got two guys that are gonna be after you tonight. Oh, yeah. And one of them can run. Yes. Yeah. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Do we have another hat woman? This yeah, is fun. another hat. This is awesome. This is a good time. <laughs> oh, so very cute. This is nice. This is nice. I like the whole ensemble. This is very. 
Uh, this is a woman, a very East Coast New York uh, uh, type of woman that, that's just all about the town. And she she added the, the hat to go with a great outfit. And it's just a little touch of class. And okay. she's all about that. I'm going to go deep on you. This is a girl who's about to go from being a fun, loving, free spirited girl into the world of business, is about to get her whole life together and become a lawyer or something. Sophisticated and can attract a lawyer. Sis yeah. Exactly. Sophisticated. Dude, okay. What's up? Do we work up all about these hats? Yeah, very good. Okay. Oh my gosh. Hey, thank you very much. I thank appreciate you it. You're a pleasure being thank here. You. I hope we did okay. Listen, thank for you. more information on hotinds.com, just check out our website. We'll be right back with more stuff. Redemption for you, Style okay. File. This morning in Style File, you know, watching the show, I'm a big fan of hats because sometimes I wear my hair's a little greasy and I'm having a bad hair day. You pop that hat on, newsboy caps, western hats, you name it, I love it. Now, we're going to meet the designers who make one of my favorite uh, accessories kind of hip and happen and take a look. They are the must have accessory this season hats. Style File loves the one of a kind design from eyelids, named for the hottest spot on the body. Meet Lisa Marie and Kristen, two aspiring actresses who wanted to start a business on the downside. We decided that there was something missing in the whole you know, fashion business and it was hats. And since then, hats have come back really strongly. So we made the right business choice. And just like finding the right blouse or earrings, hats are now part of a person's wardrobe, changing from day to day. They're like the, the only accessory, really, that can, can change your personality. Like, you can wear a hat like this and come off as like a total rocker or a cowgirl or something. And then you can wear something like this and come off as like very sophisticated or very like sweet and cute. Celebrities are also big fans. This is a hat that we designed for Pamela Anderson in pink, and we put feathers and rhinestones on it. Carmen Electra and I immediately fell in love with their hats when we spotted them at a movie premiere. Before I got an opportunity to go up to Carmen, she actually got me first and said, I love your hat, Julian and I were just talking about how much we loved your hat, you know, where can I get one? And I said, well, actually, I make them, so I can make you guys hats. So it was pretty cool. Hmm, I think Carmen got hers. I'm still waiting for mine to find out. No, actually, I got a really cute one I'm so excited about. To find out where you can get their hats, you can log on to hoteyelids.com. How cute are they? Check out our website, too, fox11la.com. It was the brown one that I was wearing last week with the little appliques on the side, and you said, gosh, you look so cute in that. Okay, you didn't say that, but, you know. I have to figure out what applique wearing... means. I don't know what applique is. <laughs> little, they're little flowers. Oh. See that boy driving, and it scares the hell out of me. All right, today in Style File, actually, Lifestyle File. Ooh, it's on how can a hat and later? Can different hats help you attract the man of your dreams? Meet the women who say yes, and they're here to show you. Coming up, they not only add to your own unique style, they can actually help you attract Mr. Right. Up next, find out which hat could help you find true love.